We need this to let us go to the other islands. Let's just put it here for now. Now I feel bad for killing these guys in the RPG. <laughs> yeah, maybe this one was a special case. He was a nice one. The other ones were bad. <laughs> I mean, actually, this game, a lot of the monsters are friendly. So you're you're not far off. Like, you're kind of like, oh, they had like a whole society. I didn't know that. <laughs> uh, okay, so let's check out. Let's check this out. This will be the last thing we do. We're gonna take a look at some player-made islands. Today's top islands. Wow, that one looks good. This is number one. LOL, they have names and personality. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. What looks good? Some of them, like, you definitely, the... The frame rate takes a bit of a, a dive. Well, let's, let's take a look at this one. R3 to visit island. It's the number one island, so... Should be a good one, right? Let's take a look. Maybe we can get some good ideas on how to make our own island look cool. It it doesn't even take long to this load it up. This better be good, or I want a refund. <laughs> it's it's it. I was really impressed uh, when I came here, came to other islands before. Like, even that, that's pretty cool, too. Look at that. That's amazing. Here we are. So, yeah, this is the main island for this, this player, Audrey. Bedroom. Got some, uh, stuff. Wait, draw? Oh, draw the curtains? I didn't know you could do that. Got a light. Super fancy beds. Oh, overlooking. Ooh, it's got a nice road. Bunch of houses. Oh, look at that tower over there. Cool. I'm avoiding all PlayStation threads on reset. It's all doom and gloom. Uh -huh. Making me depressed. Aww, it's... You just gotta laugh. You just gotta laugh. <laughs> That's all you can do is laugh, man. I feel like Sony got caught with their pants down, dude. They, uh... They were busy, like, getting exclusives... For, like, you know, Call of Duty exclusive content, blah blah blah, and then Microsoft was like, uh, how about we just buy the entire studio, uh, the entire publisher. Wow, look at that painting. That's cool. Okay, well this is this is the same building that we've been in. At least the frame rate in this town is better. The the first town that I went to, and that's up on my YouTube actually. Uh, you can get to the links on my YouTube channel just by checking out my about page. But yeah, it was so slow. It was chugging big time. What's this? A toilet? It's like any dev Sony collapse with ends up being bought by MS. Oh well, yeah, I mean that's Microsoft's like. That they have. What did Batman say in uh, in Justice League? His superpower is that he's rich, and that's that's basically what Microsoft's superpower is. They don't actually have like the insight to like get cool studios to work with them and foster like these good relationships from the ground up, like micro that like Sony tends to do. But instead, their superpower is money. They can just basically like. Hey, Microsoft that... buys Activision, <sighs> Sony buys five guys in a garage. <laughs> yeah, five First guys in a garage studio. <laughs> yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Five guys in a studio. Look forward to their, you know, their indie game that they'll make or whatever. Whoa, fast nothingness. I mean, Sony will probably do something, but it won't be on the same scale because I don't think they have 70 billion dollars to spend. 
it's uh it's actually comically crazy how much money they spent on uh, activision 70 billion dollars like i was talking about this with uh with night trap but like when microsoft bought mojang the makers of minecraft that was four billion and when disney bought marvel that was also like four, like something like four billion 70 billion dude I mean obviously like it's multiple properties that they now own so it it makes kind of sense but that is still an obscene amount of money it's over here okay it looks like there's something over there too funny thing is I'll end up looking forward to those indie games more than the trash from Activision <laughs> uh, I don't know I don't know. Like it's it's actually not like the At individual least this is how I'm coping with this. It's not it's not the individual games that that make a difference. It's actually the trend, the dangerous trend that is precedent that has now been set by uh by Microsoft and and the writings were on the wall with with the purchase of Bethesda, right? Like it wasn't a one-time deal. They were going to buy more. And Sony thought, okay, well, we're just going to buy, like, you know, Four Guys Studio and, like, you know, their next indie darling game, blah, blah, blah. And, like, you know, this VR company and a PC porting company and a support studio, blah, blah, blah. They thought that would have been fine as a response. But they didn't realize that it wasn't just a... This was just a start and... And uh, Activision was Microsoft next. Only feels wrong. Yep, it feels wrong. It feels wrong. Well, some reports are saying that um, they will they will be um, wait, can't I place this stuff? What? 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 Oh, okay. Here we go. This ain't your island. No, hell no. This isn't my island. This is one of the player-made islands. It's so nice. Whee! This is like a different, a different island. Yeah, I thought I made that clear. But anyways, um, oh shit! There we go. What's over here? It looks evil. Oh, okay, I think I know where that is. This is actually... Yeah, this is uh, the normal stuff from the Isle of Awakening. I wonder where they built the water. Uh, if they made no, the river. I thought you couldn't place blocks because this isn't your island. Oh, I see, I see. Yeah, yeah, it's fine. You can make, you can do that. It's just that, like, the some of those tiles there, the roof tiles that are flat, uh, that's considered a, a block. So I was basically putting a block on a block, even though that that roof tile is like a super flat texture. It's considered a block. That was the weird thing. But I was able to put it on a slope. Maybe it will be like the NBA. I'll trade you bug snacks for Call of Duty. I think so, but I don't think uh, Microsoft is gonna bite on that one. <laughs> bug snacks? They're not gonna bite on that. Maybe Banjo Kazooie for bug snacks. That's a bit more appropriate. Oh, what? What is this? They made an icon. Oh yeah, you can fast travel too. So, what else have they made here? They can't say no to knack. <laughs> can't say no to knack. Yeah, so I think I think Sony will will ultimately do something, but it it's not going to be on the scale of that. It they don't have the money. If anything, I could see like a partnership being formed. I'm sure you guys talked about this all already on your podcast. I just uh yeah, I was busy doing stuff for my for my uh YouTube channel. So I, I didn't actually tune in, but Ooh, look at this place. This looks fancy. That is the Ben Simmons of Sony. Uh, ben Simmons. Hey, you know what? Mac, Mac is a shooter, though. Let me tell you something. Mac is a shooter. Mac is ready. Ready to go. 
if oh look at this if he's called to action he's ready to go oh there's showers it's funny I'm kind of getting spoiled on like future future furnishings pretty nice pretty nice ooh what's this Why it's a you giant to do the to Simmons <laughs> This is a big pyramid. What's up here? LOL. Hmm. Oh, look at this thing. I saw this before, but I didn't know how to draw, how to move it, how to operate it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, this is the gas. Can it fly or something? It has like such a magical sound effect that makes me think. Whoa, it's so fast though. It's mad slippery. Like whenever, uh, whenever I play Halo, Honestly, I, I'm never the Sony guy. Is better off just keep the building on their own IP. Uh, yeah, but okay. So this is what's going to happen. Um, inevitably, eventually, Sony will basically just be like Nintendo. They're they're just gonna be. Oh. A, a company where and a platform where people will will just buy the couple of games that they like that are exclusive just like Nintendo like you want to buy the latest Mario game well you got to get Nintendo you want to get the latest Kratos game well you got to get a PlayStation but as far as third parties go that's no longer an option you're gonna have to buy uh, a PC or or uh, or the next Xbox. And that's just how it's gonna be, unless Sony makes some moves. That's kind of the danger and the threat, right? That's the only way to survive against three trillion dollars. Three Could trillion Xbox dollars. Be the Lakers, old <sighs> properties, and selling only on name. Yeah, I I heard that you were comparing uh uh the rap. Oh no, Bacon was comparing the Raptors to uh. <laughs> the, to the to Sony now. <laughs> okay, let's uh let's back out. Three trillion dollars and like EA, I'm telling you, EA, Sony Ubisoft, the or Raptors. <laughs> I have no idea who Sony is in such a comparison, because right now, it's and just Xbox is totally Lakers or it's Yankees. up in the air. Oh, let's go back into the main game. It's a it's it's a I very so weird Phoenix thought. Suns. The Phoenix th Suns. <laughs> yeah, it's really interesting. It's interesting times we live in, man. I have to say. I'm very interested in seeing what happens next. Like, let me tell you something. This will be the last thing I I, I'll say. Uh, a long time ago, I was the biggest Nintendo fan. Obviously, like any any kid who grew up in the '80s. Nintendo Super Nintendo, right? And when the next generation was about to come out, let's get a good look on my character's face. When the next generation was about to come out, it became clear that Final Fantasy, a bunch of Square so Square games, they were just called Square, Squaresoft, like Final Fantasy, and Capcom, a lot of the fighting games like Street Fighter, were not going to be on the Nintendo 64. They were going to be on PlayStation. And I jumped ship. And I'm telling you right now, if something like that happens again, and, and it doesn't even have to be Square Enix, right? Because these days I'm not that in love with Square Enix games. I don't really, I haven't played the latest Final Fantasy games. I'm playing Dragon Quest now. But if something like that happens again, where Capcom or or Square Enix or, or From Software, that's a company where I'll follow to the ends of the earth, right? Wherever those guys go, if it's not Sony, I'm going there. I'm going wherever they go. And that's just how it is, you know? It's kind of a, a sad thought to think about, but I did it before a long time ago when I was a young kid. And uh, there's really no reason to to and have... If all my JRPG goes to Xbox, then I'm yeah, the, an Xbox fan. Yeah, the next, the next, near, the next near Automata game 
the next FromSoft game. Uh, you don't have to be loyal to any of these companies. Mary Trunks is often uh, hammering home that that thought. You know, you don't have to be slavishly uh, uh, loyal to these guys. So, if that's what happens, that's what happens. Ooh. I just realized that you have these emotes here. But for now, it's a little frustrating and I'm going to stomp. Mm. See? Like that. <laughs> but I think uh, that's going to do it for me, guys. It's been fun. It's been some good laughs. And uh, if you made it this far, thanks for watching. I'll catch you next time. Where's the wave? Goodbye. See you guys.